In this video, we will learn how to configure cells for multiple line input. If we configure the cells in a list box, table or tree control, To create a new line in a cell, when we press the enter key on the keyboard, right click the control and select multi-line input from the shortcut menu. If this item is not selected, then when we press enter, we are taken to a new cell in a new row. But if we enable multi-line input, click in a cell, press enter, then the text is entered multiple lines in the same cell. You saw as I entered three lines, the width of the cell increased. This happened because auto size row height was enabled by default. So enabling this option resizes each row to its contents and display all the data in each cell. We can also use the multiple line input property to configure the cells in the list box, multi-column list box, table or tree control to create a new line in a cell programmatically when we press the enter key. So now that the multi-line input is turned off. If I enter multi lines and press enter, I am taking taken to a new cell in a new row. But I, if I enable it, run the code, then enter the text. Then I am allowed to enter multiple lines in the same cell.